Hi, this is the homework for lesson 10 of second grade module two. Get your name on there first. Don't leave it for later because you won't remember it later and you won't get credit for your homework. And we're working on uh, using the RDW process to solve. Read, draw, and write. We're drawing a tape diagram for each step for problem one has been started for you they already drew the tape diagram for us so here it starts off with there is a there's 29 centimeters of green ribbon it's green ribbon a blue ribbon is nine centimeters shorter than the green ribbon how long is the blue ribbon so here's the picture that's you know that's a lot of green ribbon blue ribbon shorter than longer than that's a, if you try and a lot of times you try and solve all that in your head without drawing a picture of it first, you can get crossed up. It's really worth it. And, and there's going to be more than one question on this information. So you want to make sure you get it right in the beginning. So here's the picture. We have the green ribbon. That's 29, right? That's the first thing it said. And the blue ribbon is nine centimeters shorter. So, you know, if it was the same, it would go to here, but it's this much shorter and we're calling that nine is the difference between the two we don't know how long it is find the length of the blue ribbon well it's the difference between 29 and 9 right so we read it it's drawn for us already so we're gonna write the equation 29 minus 9 equals what well you can see you're taking away the nine ones you're just gonna have the 20 left And we just have to write our answer now. The blue ribbon and these are centimeters. The blue ribbon is 20 centimeters long. Step two. Find the length of both the blue and green ribbons. Now, I, when I draw tape diagrams for addition, usually I would draw them end to end like this. Right? One, and then the other one makes it longer, so they should go. That makes sense to me, right? To figure that out for it. But sometimes you don't draw it that way. <clears throat> you don't realize it. It can look like this, too. So we have this bracket here instead that says... How much are these two things put together, even though they don't look like they're put together, they're side by side, or on top or on bottom? This bracket here says, what is it, if we combine these two, how much is it going to be? Find the length of both the blue and the green ribbons. So, we know it's, we already have the picture here, so we need the blue ribbon, 20, plus the green ribbon 29 equals and we got you know 20 we could do a little taped a uh, little number bond here the two 20s together is 40 right because that's 10 20 30 40 and then there's nine more 49 both ribbons together oh, my pen's not right now are 49 centimeters Sorry, it's a little sloppy. Uh, Joanna and Lisa drew lines. Joanna's line is 41 centimeters long. Lisa's line is 19 longer 
than Joanne is. It's not 19. It's 19 longer. You've got to read every single word or something like this will really change what you're doing with the numbers. So you really have to be careful about these. Uh, how long are Joanna's and Lisa's lines? So if we're going to find out how long Joanna's and Lisa's lines are together, we would have to know what both of them are so that we could add them together. But we don't know what one of them is. We only know Joanna's line. We know Joanna's line, but we, we know Lisa's line is longer than that, but we don't know exactly what it is. So we have to find that out first before we can add them together. So this is a two-step problem. The first step is find the length of Lisa's line. Right, because this is going to end up being... You know, suppose we just drew it like the one that was above, right? We know Joanna's line is 41... That's Joanna's line. We'll just write it right in the middle here. 41 centimeters. And we know that Lisa's line is longer than that. Right? And we want to find the two of them together. Right? We don't know how long Lisa's line is. So that's what we have to find out in the end. But first we have to find out what this is before we can add them together. So we have to find the length of Lisa's line. And that's not going to be too complicated. But that's what this tape diagram is for. We know this is Joanna's line. This is going to look a lot like the same picture below, but except I'm going to have a little more information in here. Joanna's is still 41. Lisa's is 19 more, 19 longer. So this is the more. This part here is the more. That's the longer. And we know that's 19. What we don't know is this. But we do know that, right? Because that's the same as, right? These are the same right here. So we know that this part of Lisa's line is the same as Joanna's line. So... This has to be 41. So Lisa's line is going to be this right here. It's going to be 41 plus the 19, right? So that's what we have to add together. And you might see this. Hopefully... You're so good at your parts to 10 that right away you see this 1 and this 9, and you're thinking, how can I make a 10 out of that and use it? <clears throat> so you've got 40 and 10 more. That's 50, right? And then this 1 and this 9 make another 10. So it's 50 and another 10, 60. Right? You could draw it like this and kind of show that the 1 and the 9 came together for another 10. And then you've got 40 and two tens, and that's 60. But so now we just have to write down our answer, right? Lisa's line is 60 centimeters. And then the total length of their line, we know Lisa's line, we know what this question mark is down here for step two. It's 60. So now we have to add the 60 and the 41. You might recognize six and four as one of the combinations to 10. Except these are not ones, these are tens we're adding together. So that's 10 tens. And if you count 10 10s, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, that's 100. So there's 100, and then there's this one more left. So 100 plus one more, 101. Right, because this is, and you can just do this, 40 and 1, and that's 100. And this is still the 1, so it's 101. And now we just have to write down the answer. 
and I haven't left myself a lot of room to write it down. So I'm just going to write it down. I mean, I'm going to have to write on top of all this stuff down here. All this stuff down here, I'm just going to have to write it, just write it over that. There's nowhere else to put it because I just took all the space up with my work. So, uh, the two lines total 101 cm.